I'm Jeremy Davis, a consultant ENT surgeon at Medway NHS Foundation Trust. I'm here to discuss the inclusion of snoring surgery in the NHS evidence-based intervention programme. Snoring is caused by vibration at the back of the tongue, the back of the throat, and whilst it's extremely irritating, in the majority of individuals it's not dangerous. It's important to note that the evidence-based interventions programme is looking at snoring on its own and not snoring associated with obstructive sleep apnea, which is a more serious condition and does need treating. Surgery to help snoring is no longer generally recommended. Um, we know that after two years, most studies show that such surgery doesn't give much benefit. It may do initially, but not after two years. And it has risks such as bleeding, infection, um, you can get change of taste, and even death can be associated with snoring surgery. If a GP diagnoses possible obstructive sleep apnea in a patient, they will refer that patient for, to a specialist centre for further investigation. However, if the patient's thought to just have snoring without obstructive sleep apnea, then there are a number of uh, interventions that can be tried, such as weight loss, stopping smoking, stopping drinking, and sometimes a device to bring the back of the tongue forwards, which can be helpful. We would no longer recommend surgery for snoring in that situation. I specialise in the treatment of patients with ear, nose and throat conditions, including those with head and neck cancer. The evidence-based interventions programme will potentially reduce the number of patients referred for conditions which we would not be offering surgical treatment in an ENT clinic and do not need an ENT um, opinion and free up time for those patients with more serious or sinister disease to allow us to see them. I and my colleagues at ENT UK strongly support the fact that snoring surgery has been included in the evidence-based interventions programme and this should um, enable us to make better use of scarce resources.